This is a significant milestone for the community. Uh, hospital services are important for all communities and it's challenging in northern and remote areas of the province to provide the level of health care that people would like to have. So the community leaders here did a great job uh, in terms of making their case. Northern Health and the government uh, agreed that uh, this facility needed uh, to be here in the Lakes District and to have it open uh, ahead of schedule with such an amazing facility is, uh, is really uh, special I think for all of the people that have been involved and a real privilege for me as well. Well this new facility means so many things. There's all sorts of levels of meaning. I, I think locally it means a beautiful space for people to work in and I think it's going to really improve the service that we're allowed that we're able to provide in Burns Lake. It'll affect recruitment in a positive way. It'll affect retention in a positive way. You can just feel the energy as you walk through this building. It's actually going to um, it has a healing energy and a positive energy in the entire building and I know people are going to get great service here and I know it's going to help people get better sooner. Well, it's a beautiful facility, but it's also highly functional and uh, it's the high functionality that I think is the most pleasing part of the building for me. This is a facility with all of the modern technologies uh, for a rural hospital, so it's transformative for the community. The biggest difference between the old hospital and the new hospital is the fact that it's new. Um, as it stands, I think that the community of Burns Lake or the Lakes District community really feels like there's probably an outdated model of care in this community. And so being able to have a new facility with new things, new furniture, new rooms, um, seemingly state-of-the-art stuff will help all of the community feel like they're getting the, be the best kind of care. I think this is a beautiful facility and I, I like some of the extra work that's been put in and uh, there's actually a First, a First Nations room in there where you can have smudges and feasts that you can actually burn something in there and it's a good ventilation system so I, I th think in incorporating some of the First Nations aspect to this new hospital care facility is just a great idea for everybody involved. To go on the tour today and see the completed facility, it, it's just beautiful. It's something that, that we, way beyond what we had hoped for. And it's something that uh, we can be proud of and will be a blessing to the community, to the region for years to come. It's going to be a facility that will attract staff, physicians, nurses, physios, uh, you name it, all of the healthcare personnel. and not just attract but retain within our community and that's really very significant as far as the delivery of health care within any small community. So I think that this is going to be very significant. It's a facility that we can be so proud of and uh, it should be here to service us for a long time to come. When you look at health care services that are required really around the province, you want to be able to have centres that can really meet the needs of people so that they don't have to travel too far. Uh, and this facility uh, really replaces a facility that did a great job. Uh, but I think probably that the critical thing around here is uh, Burns Lake and the, and the area uh, has, a, has a great future in front of it. And it's important that the healthcare facility will be here to be able to meet those needs so that employers can attract people into the area, so that people can feel confident about uh, having families uh, moving to the area, and uh, also that uh, their parents will be able to be looked after for generations to come as well.